Sorry, Phoenix, I love you like a son, but there's just something about Miles. <laughs> Phoenix, I love you like a son, but there's just something about Miles. I love him like a sugar daddy. Ah, I said, you should confess your crime. Ergo, confess that you placed the wiretap. The wiretap? That's leading the witness. Order, order! Isn't it, Dylan? That is certainly leading the witness. You're allowed to do it on cross-examination, but this is not cross-examination. I'm cross-examinating. So yeah. ah. Exactly. Mr. Edgeworth, explain to the court what you mean by this. This would be redirect examination. Mr. White is slightly confused. Slightly? Allow me to explain. I will testify for him. I, I really don't like the way this is headed. As you know, Mr. White is the CEO of Blue Corps. He ordered his secretary, Miss April May, to tap the law offices of Miss Fay. What does that have to do? Your Honor, the question is, when was the wiretap placed in the office, and by whom? No, you you wouldn't. Mr. White, in order to place the wiretap, you entered Miss Fay's office. Oh, man! Am I correct? Oh, he's good. That would explain everything. Ugh. C correct! You are most correct, Miles. Give me a break! Yes, in order to place the wire tap, I breached the fan called law offices. That is when I saw that accursed light stand. Oh, oh, that, that does make You're sense. You're still oh. a liar! Now I'm confused. Please explain to the court what all this means, Edgeworth. You shouldn't. You're, That's not you're how really works. dumb. Technically, he's not caught in a lie yet. Cause like, sure if you about place that? It on, well, no, because if you place it on an, like an earlier date, not the murder day, then he would still know it was a light stand, and he would be able to see it from the window. He was still, like, perjurous. I'm CD perjury! Oh, no. <laughs> Gladly, Your Honor. <laughs> Dylan gets too into character. Oh, <clears throat> no. Mr. Felix Wright has made his position quite clear. I put him in that suit, and now he can't get out of it. <laughs> he has determined that Mr. White knew the glass stand was in the office. He has shown that there was only one time Mr. White could have seen the stand. At the very moment of the murder. Thus, Mr. White would like you to believe that Mr. White was the murderer. Which he is. Oh, I see. <laughs> However, it is the fact that Mr. White had been to the office well before the murder took place. When he went to the place that wiretap, you could have seen the glass light stand by then. <laughs> Ergo, Mr. Phoenix Wright's theory is revealed for the baseless conjecture that it is. God damn it, Miles. Mr. Wright, you will testify to the court about this wiretapping. <laughs> uh -huh. Knock him down again. <laughs> Leave it to me. I, I, I feel faint. I, I, I need that recess now, Judge. Uh, that snack. Not allowed. My, my snack. My, my blood sugar. It was the beginning of September. The week before the murder, I had entered the Fane Cole Law Office. Of course, I had done so to place the wiretap. That is when I saw this god-awful glass light stand. There's gotta be something about the date. Yeah. That was very specific. Hmm. So, you saw the stand before the night of the incident. And this is how you were able to identify what had fallen over by the sound. Even I think that's suspicious. <laughs> Correct. That is right. I see. Very well, Mr. Wright. You may begin your cross-examination. I totally said that line wrong. Gah! What am I supposed to do now? Good luck, Phoenix. I need all the luck I can get. Uh, I'm gonna press the date. The week before the murder. D do you have proof? Objection! This April May knew the details of Miss Faye's phone conversation. This proved that the wiretap was placed before the murder. Yeah. Huh. Right. Tap. Why did you tap me his phone? Objection! This has no bearing on the current case, Your Honor. Why are we not allowed to ask that? Objection irrelevant is a valid objection. Uh, the judge has to give a ruling, what the fuck? He's just going off. Blue Corp is a detective agency, of course. So confident. We have a responsibility to protect client confidentiality. Oh, so much for that. Can you press that? Yeah, I can. I can press everything they say. And I don't think I get any, like, negatives for it. Why did you notice something as innocuous as a light stand? The light stand was made entirely out of glass. It was quite stylish, so I guess it made a lasting impression on me. Such a mutatious thing deserves attention, does it not? That is all. Damn it. There's nothing here for me to press him on. Oh well, maybe he's rattled enough that I can bluff something out of him. 
So we did that. Yeah. I'm gonna do this one. We haven't pressed this one. Why did you enter? Was it oh, okay, really come on, you Phoenix. That went into the office. Or was it Miss May? Hmm. Objection. Unidentified fingerprints several days ago were found in the Feng Co law offices. Oh, there we go. Fingerprints. Those were obviously Mr. White's. Uh, can we get confirmation on that, please? And if I know Edgeworth, he's already run a check on those prints. A bow. Now, Mr. White, tell us why you went to the Fay Co. Law Offices. Uh-oh, don't tell me I've run out of ammo. No, Phoenix! I'm afraid that's as far as you go, Mr. White. Oh, sorry, Mr. Wright. <laughs> it's hard. It really the is. The come for you to admit your defeat. You fought... Honorably. A bow. No more. I can't take this anymore. Mr. Wright, are you giving up? Uh, oh, what? It, it's scripted. It must Ye be. Yes, Your Honor. Who's saying this? Uh, oh, uh, Phoenix. Huh? Phoenix, over here. Um, I, I know that voice. M Mia? <laughs> okay, you're either hallucinating from stress or, uh... Maya's done something. Maya's done something media me. Oh, channeling the <laughs> Wait, spirit. No. There we go. Wait, this is the shit. You can now say you pleaded Saturday because uh, you're seeing. You're oh seeing God, ghosts. No. Never give up, Phoenix. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I fucking blacked out. Did you faint? I fainted. <laughs> where, where am I? Here's that recess. The waiting lobby. What, what happened? Oh, right. I lost the trial. I, I was hallucinating. Well, I was... <laughs> <laughs> huh, you're finally awake. Gek! Was well, this oh, how you reacted again. to being an old co-worker? <laughs> hey, Phoenix! Gak? That's no way to greet an old friend. Phoenix, <laughs> I want you to look at me. <laughs> this is the afterlife. They're both dead. He had a heart attack. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no! What? What? Wait, what? When did her when did her shirt open? What is happening? I would have noticed. <laughs> this just happened. <laughs> this just happened. Your your M M Maya? Didn't you know the Fey women have strong psychic powers? When you accepted your defeat in court. Oh, it's the spirit of Mia talking through Maya as like a vessel. So she has changed her like demeanor and look, oh, her look. to vibe as Mia. <laughs> to vibe. It appears that was enough of a shock to awaken Maya's true powers. So Maya is channeling you, Mia? That's right. I am Maya, but I'm also Mia. Now, I want you to listen to me, Phoenix. Maya never gave up. You can't either. That's what I came here to tell you. Uh, but, but. We don't have much time, Phoenix. Now listen. You've already won. Uh, huh? You have that receipt in the court record, right? Um, oh, yeah. The one you wrote Maya on? Phoenix, White wrote that, not me. Yeah, I knew that, Phoenix. Come on. Well, he did just pass out, like, twice. <laughs> that is true. So, so, what do I do with it? Look at the front of the receipt. <laughs> I can't, I don't have a flip the paper button, guys. Come on. The... Front? Okay, Phoenix, I thought you were a little better than this. <laughs> Property of Blue Corp Industries. It's a regular receipt. Looks like it's from a famous department store. A thousand dollars. Wow, big spender. Item, glass light stand. What? <laughs> Did he put the light stand in her uh, office? No, I, I think it's just that she bought it recently. Oh, you're right. There you go. Date of purchase, September 4th. <gasps> September 4th! That's right, Phoenix. I bought that stand the day before I was killed. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Whoa! Now, what did Mr. White say in his testimony? He said he saw the nightstand a week before the murder. There you go. I think the court is about to reconvene. Go do it, Phoenix. You know you're innocent, now you just have to prove it. 
But I'm innocent until proven guilty. You are not guilty. Well, so, the argument is that there's evidence to suggest you're guilty. Now you just gotta rebut that evidence. There's very little evidence besides one dude saying that it was me. Like, come on. Whoa, well, one dude is One dude who literally apparently Alien controls the entire uh, right. law system. Right. How convenient. Dun, dun. So the lesson from this? Pass out in the middle of court. It'll, it'll work out great for you. No, the it's lesson true. of this is flip over every sheet of paper you get. No. <laughs> the lesson of this is whenever you need assistance, apparently the answer is cleavage. <laughs> I thought you were going to say get a spirit medium. I did. I mean, huh. September 9th, 1.16 p.m. District Court, courtroom number one. <laughs> Court will now reconvene for the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright. Is the defendant rather? Are you all right, Mr. Wright? Oh, thanks for being friendly. Uh, y yes. Sorry, Your Honor. I, I didn't get my like mid-afternoon snack when I decided to push through that earlier call for recess, so I I I'm fine now. Well, you should have said something if you had low blood sugar, right? <laughs> but we'll start where we left off. Your I love Honor, that animation. I have an effect on men, I understand. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing to go back to. There's plenty. The cross-examination of Mr. White is finished. All that is required now is for you to pass judgment on the defendant to Phoenix Wright. Objection! Tap! Your Honor, please, give me one more chance. I promise you, this is the last time I'll ask you this specific trial. Hmm... But as Edgeworth has noted, the trial is more or less finished. Mr. Edgeworth, do you have an opinion on this matter? I bet he's gonna be so cocky, he's gonna be like, ha, huh, he can try. A bow, I say. Let us give Mr. Phoenix Wright his last chance. Oh, you'll regret that. Very well, very well. You may begin your cross-examination. We got it this time. Let's do it. This is Get it. Get them. They, they practically spelled it out for you, honestly. They literally did spell it out. That's it. That makes Objection. sense. Objection. Look closely at this. See the word Maya written in blood? <laughs> You're grasping. Tap. Am I? I think not. Look at the other side of the receipt. <laughs> The, the other side? <laughs> huh. He didn't think to flip it! I knew that if I didn't think of it, Edgeworth, you wouldn't have either. Your uh, Honor, <laughs> would you tell the court what is written on the other side of that receipt? Because none of us thought to flip it over. Wait, hmm. he's the court. Oh, you're right. Hmm. Well, a glass light stand. And the date of purchase? Why, it's the day before the murder. <gasps> <sighs> <laughs> you see, Mr. White, that when you allegedly entered the Fay and Co. law offices at the beginning of September, the stand could not have been there. Ha. <laughs> well, Mr. White, can't get out of this one, can you? It's achievable. Uh, uh oh, he's losing it. Say that like he had it before. Well, Your Honor, I understand there must be quite a bit of pressure on you. Tap. But I think you'll agree you can't judge me guilty under these circumstances. Most unorthodox. Very well. Then, that is all for the trial of. Pause for dramatic effect. Aw, oh, man! Not so fast, Phoenix White. Miles, give up! Eh? What? No way he could worm his way out of this one. Oh, wait. I forgot. It's Edgeworth. The wormiest of them all. Bow. That is my name. There is a certain threat of logic the defendants claim. You guys, unbelievable. <laughs> However, there is no concrete proof that Phoenix White is in it. Uh, Ergo, I would like to request one more day before Phoenix Wright is granted his freedom. Oh no, day three of the trial! I need uh -oh. time to make more inquiry into this matter. You need more time to forge evidence! Another inquiry? This isn't gonna be another one of those updated autopsy reports. This yes, guy just is. makes up evidence as he pleases. This is bad. I'm gonna eject. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna I do. Eject. This is bullshit! Tap! Mr. White's guilt is obvious. There's no need to prolong this trial any further. Hmm. 
Well, Mr. Edgeworth? If anyone is going to call Mr. White to trial, it would be me, the prosecution. I need a day to ascertain whether these new claims have any basis in factual evidence. Ugh, shut it, Edgeworth. I see. Objection denied! What? Sorry, Phoenix, I love you like a son, but there's just something about Miles. <laughs> The completion of the trial of Mr. Phoenix Wright will be postponed until tomorrow. <laughs> Phoenix, I love you like a son, but there's just something about Miles. I love him like a sugar daddy. He lets him break both of them, all these court rules. <laughs> I'd like to sustain more than an objection from him. Oh. Uh, uh, no, there's no telling what will happen if I can't end this now. Edgeworth is sure to come up with, or just make up something. And after Mia showed up to help me and all... Mr. Your Honor, may I go home? Of course. What? Thank you for your time. Gah! The witness will stay. Oh, it's still Mia. Ghost can testify in court now. M uh, Mia. Phoenix, read this note out loud. Mia, wh what is this? I I'm trying not to faint again. A list of people's names in Mia's handwriting. Oh, now she can write as Mia in Mia's handwriting. Your there Honor. There we go. If I may. Wait, talk about forging evidence! <laughs> you're, you're quite persistent today, Mr. Wright. It's her, just back from the dead. D -d 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 Objection! Any... Your Honor, I saw They have used mediums there. in court before. This is nothing new. You bet I am. My life is riding on this one. I have I... something oh. I would like to what read to the court. Judge, <laughs> judge please I'm let not... me speak. Take that! The memo Mia had given me was a list of names. Many of them sounded strangely familiar. People in finance, famous celebrities. That's when it happened. This is halt! Please! Yeah, that's not how this works. Please stop! Make him stop! He's not a witness! He can't testify! How did you get that list? Mr. White, admit your guilt right here right now or else this list will be released to the press this does not sound kosher at all it really doesn't dylan this is not kosher at all. <laughs> silence i i confess i confess <gasps> we got I, I him i hit her i hit miss mia with the thinker case closed your honor <laughs> <laughs> Well, I see no reason to continue this trial. Mr. Wright. Yes, Your Honor. You've done it again. That was quite a spirited defense. <laughs> Even though I was incredibly bribed, you still did it, right? No, he means spirited, because there was a possession. Ah. Uh, Pun. Yes, Your Honor. I, I guess you could say that. Ugh. <laughs> if only you knew how spirited it was. <laughs> Hmm. Well, this court finds the defense, ahem, <clears throat> rather, the defendant, Mr. Phoenix Wright, <laughs> not guilty. We blackmailed the blackmailer. It was very satisfying. That is all. The court is adjourned. Dun dun. September 9th, 2.24 p.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby, number one. Well, I never thought I'd be saying this again, but congratulations! You're lucky I was born a fae. I'm lucky I had both you and Maya on my side. I'm glad you made it. Thank you, Phoenix. You risked a lot to help me. And Maya. My freaking freedom! I won't forget it as long as I live. Oh! I, I'm dead now, so I've already forgotten. A as long as you live. My time here is running out. Huh? Maya's powers are still weak. I can't stay here that long. W what? No, there's still so much to say. Don't worry. I'm sure we'll meet again. Ch chief <laughs> I'm not the chief anymore. Phoenix, can you come to the office tonight? Say, nine o'clock. The office? I'll see you later. Chief, Mia, Maya, whoever you are. Dun -dun. September 9th. 9.02 p.m. Fay and Co. Law Offices. Just fashionably late. Being here, it's hard not to think about that night. You came! Mia? I was kind of worried you might not. Huh? Uh, of course I came! Well then, I'm pretty hungry. 
How about burger? No, nah, that's Maya. M Mia? <laughs> you should see your face. Mia. Uh, what are you talking about? It's me, Maya. You guys sound like identical. M Maya? What? Did I look like my sister? I mean, kinda. No. Ace, for legal reasons, you have to say no. <laughs> <laughs> look like you were her, but that's... I might be able to use that. Oh, Phoenix, go to the store and buy me lunch, <laughs> would you? <laughs> um, Maya, why are you here? Because of this. See? Mia wrote me a letter. Take care of Phoenix for me. Take care of... huh? She means the office. This office. Someone has to help with the new writing co law offices, right? It is my office! And who better but me? Maya Faye, reporting for duty. Wait, no, on second thought, let's make this casual. Yo, Nick! Maya here, ready to get down to business! Okay, like I've said before, if my name was Phoenix, no one would ever get away with calling me Nick. That's just lame as hell. It, it really is. You don't mind me calling you Nick, do you? Your Nick name! Ugh. It's a great name! Mia said that's what your friend Larry calls you. Nick? You know what this means? We're partners! You know, when I think about it, it's Maya's fault I'm here now. Well, I but wouldn't say fault. If it wasn't for her, I'd probably be in jail! Right in co-law offices. It's got a good ring to it. Yeah. Thanks, Maya. Good luck, Phoenix. I'll always be here. Aww. Watching. Oh. That's sweet. Right! Okay, Nick, let's do it. Huh? Do what? Burgers, dummy. Burgers. There's a great burger joint just down the street. Come on, time's a wasting. Uh, oh, okay, wait up. That was a fun case. We hope you enjoyed watching this episode of the Arcade Cabinet. You can catch us recording these sessions live on Wednesdays at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe below if you like terrible parkour and even worse voice acting. See you, See next, you next time. time.